I see a bunch of people posting all these business checks. I want to see the custom orders. People don't typically understand why custom orders are so expensive. So I wanted to start a trend to show the world all the love that actually goes into making a custom order. Small business owners, who's with me? Depop, I do personalized style bundles, which is where you tell me everything about your style, and for $70, I pick out a bundle for you. I pick out two full outfits, three to four extra tops, and accessories, and this is one I just finished, and I'm obsessed with it. So today, we're gonna be reviewing a small business that I found here on TikTok. This is Sensi. I hope I said that right. Which is owned by a 19 year old girl who hand makes all of her own jewelry. Her sister actually reached out to me and told me what a hard worker she was and asked if I could take a look at her stuff. And the pieces she makes, they're just oof, so gorgeous. Let's go ahead and just pop these out real quick. Each one is like individually wrapped like that. So cute. I ordered a bunch of earrings from her, so we're gonna go ahead and try them on. Oh my god, look at these little sunflowers. I am obsessed. And these aren't prints, like these are these are handmade. We're not getting dolled up. We're getting falled up around here. Next, we have these. I love them. Oh my god, look at these ones. Y'all know green is my favorite color, but oh, these are nice and thick. Love them. Okay, these are funky. Nice and glossy. Oh man, check these ones out. I love them. Next, we have these little cuties. So cute. And finally, we have these. Definitely gonna order more in the future. Today, I'll be packaging our Lucky Ducky bundle. It includes this yellow heart scrunchie. This adorable pair of ducky earrings, her ducky gloss, which actually matches the scrunchie, and this ducky necklace. Here's our luxe package.
Let's take a look at some products that are in my shop right now. First up we have applesauce which is an extremely thick jelly texture that comes with jelly cubes to add some extra texture. It is scented exactly like apples and is so fun to squish. Next up we have blue hawaiian which is a really thick clear slime. My favorite thing about this slime is the amazing scent. It is scented exactly like blue hawaiian which smells exactly like capri sun. Finally we have orchata which has been a best seller in my shop for a very long time. It has a thick white glue base and comes with a gold leaf for you to mix in yourself. It is scented exactly like oatmeal sugar cookies which is one of my favorite scents as well. Click the link in my bio to view my shop. Thank you. Hey guys, let's pack an order. So this is going to go out to Canada and she picked out both of our brisa tops in lavender and white, our rose top, which is currently sold out, as well as these two backless bodysuits. She also picked out one of our bags, this Jessie handbag in baby blue. And the first thing that we're going to do is we're going to apply our custom tags. My tags again are from Etsy. I believe I get around 500 for about $150. They're a little bit pricier only because they're a pink foil, which costs a little bit more, but they're definitely worth it. After I tag these up, I'm gonna fold them up and I'm gonna place them inside our poly bags. I'm then gonna take out the bag out of its packaging only to do a quality control check just to make sure that the zipper works and that there isn't any defects on it. We're gonna package this up and then I'm gonna weigh it and print out the shipping label. I didn't record this part, but I also did have to print out a customs form because this is an international order. I printed that out as well and then I applied it to the back of the package. She'll be ready to go. Hi, this is to show the durability of my stickers. You can place and replace them several times without worrying about the sticker leaving a residue or getting ripped in the process. They're also waterproof, so you can wash with hot water and soap and scrub them and the colors will not bleed and the stickers will not come off. They're also scratch resistant, so you can scratch them up with a key and they shouldn't move. Oh my gosh. Today, I made my first ever sale to Ireland. How bloody cool is that? She picked the unique set and I'm throwing in a free sheer sarong as a gift. Hopefully she spreads a good word about my business in Ireland. Time to write up a thank you note, pop the items in the bag, seal it up, stick a customs declaration form on the front of the bag and it's off to the post office we go. You guys really liked the last candy container I made for my sister, so I decided to make a new one. I started off kind of the same. I added chamoy to the bottom of the container. I then used the sour pineapple belt and started rolling them. Kind of similar to the last one, but this time it didn't have a gusher in the middle. I just kept adding more and more sour belts, and it did get a little hard towards the end because the circle started getting a lot bigger and the belt wouldn't reach. I think I used about 15 belts for this. It looks really cool. Once I thought it was big enough to fill the bottom of the container, I placed it and it was a little too big so it kind of messed up but I was able to save it. That's what it looks like once it's inside. I drizzled a little more chamoy and this time I added some of my gooby mix. I then added Sour Patch Kids to raspberry rings and neon rings and this is the final look. I hope you guys like it. Hey darlings, it's Nat from Drawling Authority and I just moved to Orlando, Florida. This is what my space looks like right now, but it definitely needs more work, but let's pack some orders. This girl ordered our gorgeous orange satin top and our pink tie top. So I head over to my shipping station and grab everything I need. I start with this AirPod sticker. She's my friend and I know she has AirPods, so I hope she likes it. Then I grab a poly mailer and all my other materials. So a business card, a sticker, and these two postcards that I designed myself. After that, I also grab a matching scrunchie, which I thought this orange one would be perfect with that top. 
Then I grab some tissue paper and head over to my cool little coffee table that pops up like this, put all the clothing in the center and fold up the sides. I put the scrunchie on top of the clothes and then wrap everything together with a sticker. I put the postcards with the order and then grab my poly mailer. These new poly mailers are 100% recyclable and reusable for returns, so they're really awesome. Put all the items inside and then weigh them to get an accurate shipping label. I then print my shipping label, put it on the package, and we're done. These are ring bombs. They are $17.95. Inside is a ring valued anywhere from $25 up to $1,000. This one was $224. They're like bath bombs, but no essential oils or fragrances, so you can't put them in your bath water. Sometimes having a small business isn't as glamorous as it seems. Could be doing the same minuscule task over and over again, or it could be filming a TikTok on your coffee mug and it falling over. Doesn't matter what it is, it's not always fun. So I want other small creators to use this sound and show their followers something that they don't even like doing that's part of their small business. It's okay to not like every step of the journey.